Thank you, David. Well, it's Wednesday, and that means it's time for Healthy Living. Today, Erica Dalton joins us from Mid-America Clinical Laboratories to talk about a bacteria that infects the stomach and the small intestine. First off, what are we talking about? Okay, we're talking about an H. pylori infection, or Helicobacter is another way that some people may know of it, and it's a very common infection. Really? It is. Um, it can cause an aching or a burning in the stomach, okay. some nausea, some vomiting, um, bloating, feeling, and some weight loss. Is this contagious? You know, it can be. It's passed um, from person to person, mm -hmm. typically through saliva. Mm -hmm. So normal contact, if you were to drink after someone who had an H. pylori infection, um, share food with each other, you might be able to pass it back and forth. Well, how can you confirm if you have this or not? Testing is probably vital at this point. It can be. Um, you know, those symptoms, most people think of those, and, and they can be the reason, you know, you can have those for a lot of different reasons. So it's mm -hmm. important to rule things in and rule things out. Okay. There are several ways you can test for it. You can do it by blood. You can do it by stool. You can do it through a biopsy of the stomach. Um, but Mid-America Clinical Laboratories offers a quick and non-invasive way I like to that. test for this. Yes, <laughs> to check for H. pylori. Okay, and what is that? It's called a breath test. Okay. And so it's as easy as it sounds. You go into the, our patient service center uh -huh. with an order from your physician, mm -hmm. and you take a breath sample. You take one deep breath, blow into a bag. Just blow in a bag. Easy bag. Okay. Cap it up. Um, they give you a small solution to drink that tastes like crystal light. So, so not bad. It's not bad at all. Tolerable. Yes. Uh, <laughs> you wait another 15 minutes, mm -hmm. you know, just to kind of, um, it's to make sure that it's, it's attaching where it needs to attach to the bacteria in your stomach. Mm -hmm. And then you take another breath and blow in a second bag. Really? Yeah. Comes into the laboratory. We stick it on a machine. Mm -hmm. We're me measuring some variation between the first and the second sample. And then the results are back to your doctor's office the next day. Is this becoming more common? People picking this up? It is. I, what what we've seen in the com in the community is that more physicians are picking it up and testing for it more frequently. Okay. Not sure that it's actually more common than it used to be. Mm -hmm. um, it may just be that it's being diagnosed more frequently. Well, let's talk about treatment. What sure. are the treatment options? It's very um, very easy to treat, usually mm -hmm. with a combination of medications. Mm -hmm. um, normally an antibiotic, because we are talking about a bacteria, so you do need antibiotics to rid your body of that infection. Mm -hmm. The second is normally a medication that reduces stomach acid. So it helps to quell some of those symptoms that you're feeling uh, within your stomach. It makes you feel better as the antibiotic is making you better. Okay, so if you have any of these symptoms, the first step is to go see your doctor. Absolutely. And then when can MidAmerica step in to help? Um, as soon as your physician might think you have H. pylori or wants to rule out the H. pylori infection, okay. he can write an order for you to take to the laboratory. Mm -hmm. um, and we'd like for you to call ahead to the patient service center. There are some fasting um, rules and regulations before sure. you can have your sample drawn. So we want to make sure that when you come, you're ready to have your test taken. And quickly, insurance companies, how does that work? We take every every insurance company we're in network with, including okay. Anthem, Cigna, Aetna, Medicare, Medicaid. Wonderful. Well, let's take a look at the information to contact Mid-America Laboratories. That's 877-803-1010. Thank you again, Erica. Thanks. Good to see you. And again, our Healthy Living segment airs right here on Wednesdays. Now, for more information on Healthy Living, be sure to go to our website at WTHITV.com. News 10 at Midday. We'll be right back.